the text to talk and to take away. And this morning we're dealing with your first love, your first love. It's the love factor this week. I want you to look at the text this morning. And the text is Isaiah 49, 15, Isaiah 49, 15. I'm going to give you the text, going to give you the talk and the takeaway. You've got to share the manna. Come on, let's build our manna fam. Welcome. If it's your first time being a part of our manna fam, let us know so we can shout you out. Isaiah 49, 15, it says this, can a mother forget her baby? She may, but I will never forget you. God talking to Israel in the book of Isaiah, the major prophet. Isaiah 49, 15, can a mother forget her baby? She may forget, but I will never forget you. God talking to Israel, let me give you the backstory. The backstory is this. Israel has messed up. They have done about whatever they wanted to do. And God is making the appeal to them and saying, look, a, a mom, and he uses the analogy, a mother may forget her baby, which is almost next to impossible. God is saying, I will never, irregardless of what you have done, I'm going to love you. I'm, I'm just going to love you. I am, I will argue uh, this morning that here is the thing. Men don't like love. Women love love and God loves love even more. Let me say that again. Men don't like love because when they fall in love, they fall and they don't want to ever feel that feeling of vulnerability again if it don't go well. Women love love because of the feeling, I believe, uh, I'm not a woman, so I can't really tell y'all help me. Uh, because of all of that that it brings to your life. And God loves love more than that. Three words I want you to remember and get, for real, for real. With God's love, you can be for real because you don't ever have to worry about being who you are with God and God saying, I can't love that. <laughs> I can't love that. God never says that. And that's what he says to Israel. He says to Israel, look, I've seen y'all do some stuff and I just can't get you out of my heart. I, you have messed up from the floor up, but I still love you. And that's one of the big things that we always think about. Can I really be for real? And that's really what breaks up relationships many times is that as a result of the person really not, I see the real you and I'm out. God says, I see the real you and I'm still in, for real. Here's the second word that I want you to remember is forever, forever. Verse 16 says, God says, I love you so much. This is how I want you to know how much I love you. I've engraved your name in the palm of my hand. Kind of reminds me of when you are in a teenage years and you know how you go and find an oak tree in the park and you carve a heart and you put your initials and his initials or vice versa because you're trying to say, you know what, we're going to be in love forever. God says, you know what, you don't even have to worry about it. I'm going to carve your name in the palm of my hand. You talking about a tattoo? Now that's a tattoo. God says, you know what? That's how much I love you. I, you can be for real around me. It's going to be forever. Here's the third word. And we got a future together. We got a future together. So many times you hold on to your heart because you, you wonder whether or not are we going to have a future together? If I give you my heart, if I give you my life, how long is this thing is going to last? Do we have a future together? In verse 16, God says this, I the, all your walls I'll never forget. The walls of the city, the beauty of the city of Jerusalem, the, the beauty of who you are, I will never forget because we have a future together. God says we got a future together. Uh, I'm never, I'm never going to forget you. And we are in this thing forever, forever. You're not getting rid of me, even if you be for real. Here's the takeaway that I want you to have this morning is this. You are God's first love. Wow. Do you not know that Jesus would have died if it was just you? 
you talking about an impact? He says, you are my first love. That's why he calls us back. Come back to your first love. I stand at the door and knock. I, I will not be refused. The Lord be with you today. May his face shine upon you, give you peace. Walk in God's love today. Know that you can be for real. Know that y'all are in it forever and you got a future together. Share the manner. Share the manner. Share the manner. I'll see you tomorrow morning as I continue to deal with the love factor. God bless you.